1980, 1990, a bunch, a bunch of young kids went through and they stole a bunch of money. This is, I paid for most of this stuff, LS or whatever. Anyway, it was designed with money and stuff like that. Anyway, 1980 or so, a bunch of kids, a bunch of black people basically realized that they can say F everyone and steal a bunch of money and basically kill a bunch of people. And they did. They killed their parents. They killed everyone. Anyway, I don't really care anymore. It's just that... And I just get pissed off because it's all old. It's Everything's old. It's all old. And I paid for most of this stuff. We were actually designing this stuff and building this stuff. It's just that the motors... Actually, even the motors. Everything's old. The only thing that's new is the computers and the, and the technology that go with it. And most of it was already invested in and done. Anyway, then a bunch of liars say that they're the inventor or they're the this or they're the that. And they're not. Anyway, they work for a bunch of black people or a bunch of other people, and it's just a bunch of lies. It's all a bunch of lies. You go back to 19, 1890, um, 1920, and you see that, 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 that basically a bunch of black people and some white people went through and they shot everyone or killed everyone or put a gun to, to, to everyone's head. You see in the films that basically everything's old. All this stuff is old. Everything's old. They're not the inventor. They have nothing to do with it. They just built some cheap whatever piece of shit. Anyway, maybe they have guns and they go shoot some people. Anyway, it's all lies. Everything's lies. So anyway, I don't really give a fuck. Rodney's lying. Rick Bush is lying. Everyone's lying. You know, nothing's new. Everything's old. A bunch of really horrible black people ran through the world shooting people. Anyway, whatever. Fuck it. These people are either working for or just some piece of shit that had some guns and they went and, and held other people hostage or whatever. In fact, I know this tennis court, actually, yeah. Anyway, it's a bunch of shit humans, basically, with guns. Anyway, yeah, whatever. They post this stuff like they actually owned it or actually built it and whatever. They, they killed a bunch of people for it. Anyway, it's all, it's all bullshit. Yeah, they collect investments or investors or whatever. And mostly, it's mostly just I invested in it. I wanted to build. So none of these things are ever going to be built or used. And if you watch some of this stuff, there's like a future dome or whatever. And there's like a film of it being flowing in that city already. Anyway, I don't really care because everyone who knew me or knew about it knew that, that I was the one who invested in all this stuff. And... And was doing it. And we actually use engines. Really super lightweight engines actually work better than, than, than batteries. So so we actually already had it. It actually worked really well already. So anyway, a bunch of Rod, people like Rodney and a bunch of other people killed. Like, like yeah, that dome in the background. If you look at that dome and that, uh, there are some flights already there. Long time ago. Like, like 1960, 1930, we already did a full-size, even a truck-size thing flying. So yeah. Anyway, I don't really care. It's just that it really pisses me off, all the lies, all the stuff. You know, Rodney Bradley, Rick Bush, Papa, everyone else, like, running around, basically just forcing people by gunpoint to, to, to build or do stuff, you know, or, or lying about everything. It's like, anyway, it just really makes me sick. But, yeah, 1989, 1990, I, I, I mean, 1989, 19, 1910, 1920, about, or, and 1940, all this stuff is old. Everything's already been done. We already invented it. It's already done. It's not Larry. It's LS. Anyway, they go through and they put the words on, on the films and stuff, or use technology to, to all, everything, all this stuff, the video of all this stuff already. Anyway, he's not, it says blah, blah, VP, whatever. It's all bullshit. It's all lies. That's not a VP. If you checked it out, everybody, everybody, everybody who looked into these, into these companies, you know, you know, they, they, they've already been paid hundreds of billions of dollars. And then they don't really produce anything. They, they just put this stuff like inventor. Uh, you know, it's all bullshit. It's all, you know, it, they, it's already been invented, it's already been built, there's already patents there. Yeah, anyway, whatever, they already invented everything. What happened was some people broke into a warehouse, found the prototypes, then shot everyone, killed everyone at the factories. Grabbed the money, grabbed the gold, ran off. Anyway, whatever. Then they thought nobody would ever notice. 
So, anyway, and mostly they build these prototypes. They play around with them for a while. Actually, what they did was was they played around with the prototypes for a while. Then, then they crashed them or sold them or just threw them away. You know, and then eventually some people build some more or they rebuild them or something like that because they realize whose who's prototypes they crashed. You know, anyway, there's all this crap. You, you you know it's why it's why it's why Starfleet it's why fake ass piece of shit Starfleet and why why the American government didn't want anybody looking at the past ever time travel is possible but Starfleet and the government doesn't want anybody looking in the past because you see all this death and destruction that led to Jimmy Carter Richard Nixon all of them basically lying their way and killing everyone and anyone to get into that White House, and then finding out that the White House means nothing. Anyway, and then it was all to kill me, but they didn't really kill me. Anyway, there's all this death and, and stuff, but it's because I was the richest person ever, and I owned all this stuff. I invested in all this stuff. Millions, billions of dollars, but I did it back when, when, when only a couple cents went a long ways. And then we built lots of stuff like this in 1989, in 1890, and 1910 and 1920. It's all very old. You know, I invested billions of dollars into it. And yeah, all this stuff. You can see in the, in the films, you see people like doing this. It's exactly like that. They just rebuilt it without a carbon fiber. And even that we already did. We built hundreds. We made millions. I made millions. It starts in Germany and Poland and then it goes, goes around, basically. <clears throat> A bunch of black people, a bunch of other people wanted to, they, they just walked, they just basically, one day they got a gun. Like I said, somewhere in Africa, this kid got, a, got, got an AK-47 when he was 15. And then he literally just walked around shooting everyone. All this stuff is old. And he even goes and tries, and kill, tries to kill these people. And whatever, I don't really care. But there are people out there that literally think that, 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 that an AK-47 means they can just go to the 7-Eleven, kill the, kill the store clerk, take all the bottles, to grab some cigarettes, and then just walk around, and basically they shoot their way across countries. Anyway, whatever. I don't really care. It happened in the past, and it was all stupid, but... Anyway, and basically a lot of people have to kill them. Or shoot them. Hey, anyway, Whatever. But basically, a bunch of kids, they drive around, you know, they drive around Afghanistan, they drive around everywhere. All the, you know, maybe that this is somewhat new, but even that, I bet, is old. Anyway, they, they get a bunch of investors, they build one or two or three, and mostly it was, it was, it was that I actually had teams investing or building this thing or, or trying to invent that thing. And they finally maybe do it if they didn't kill the people, which they probably did, right after they invented it. Like, it's Lucifer Star. L.S. And I don't really care other than, I mean, I was a creator of Diamati, and basically Richard Nixon and Papa and a bunch of other people really wanted me dead. Because they wanted to be American president or leader of the country, and basically they were really horrible. So anyway, whatever. Rodney was really horrible, too. There's a lot of horrible people in the world. So, well. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm like, can I die now? I don't give a fuck. You know, Papa pays people to, 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 to go harass other people. You know, a lot of people pay people to go harass legitimate people. Yeah, whatever. I don't really care. I'm 100 trillion years old. So, and there's two galaxies that were originally 100 trillion years, years apart. And a hundred trillion years of matter in this galaxy, and a hundred trillion years of matter in the galaxy that's coming at us. And it doesn't really matter to me anymore. I created twelve races, twelve life form types. I don't like to say races because other people say, "Well, I got twelve races too." And it's like, no, I have twelve life form types that I personally genetically created. So whatever. And as far as I'm concerned, I would rather be dead. It's all very, very stupid. And yeah, I just build on myself. I just build on myself. Anyway, I don't really care because I'm supposed to be dead right now. And I should have be dead right now because, um, I mean, even this car. We were messing around with that. 
except that one's a little bit better. We actually did that one only now that